What's up? It's Levi from Miss May I. Well, it's been since Rock on the Range back in May. What has been going on since then? I mean, obviously, this picked up pretty soon after that. Yeah, we, um, we went to Europe, did all the European festivals, and then flew straight to this. We haven't even been home yet, so it's been awesome. Well, that's like Road Warriors. Like, <laughs> that's awesome, though. I mean, Mayhem's getting ready to wrap up, so how's it been? Oh, it's the best tour we've ever done. I've had, I've never had more fun. It's been great. I'm actually sad it's over. I didn't even know there was a week left until somebody said that today. Instantly ruined my day, but it was awesome. Well, that's good though. And I'm, I'm always curious. You know, we've seen this uprise of social media. Do you guys see like the numbers of social media fluctuate like with each like touring type of festival that you do? Oh yeah, for sure. And especially it's. There's different tours that, this, there's like social media minions that will explode it up. So, uh, like that. yeah, the, the Warp Tour, like, there's kids on there that'll post the same photo a thousand times. And then Mayhem, it's the guy, it's like the metalheads that post a picture, and then they go back to work and just hang out. So it's different, it's different with each tour, but um, it's, yeah, it's, the touring definitely makes the social media explode. So I've been asking a lot of bands what their definition of mayhem is. What does it mean to you? Uh, mayhem means circle pits, headbangs, and people throwing beer and having a great... People literally get their beer thrown on them and get covered in beer, and they're like, yeah, they're not even mad at mayhem. It's great. So what's been the oddest thing that you've seen at mayhem so far? Oh, man, the oddest thing I've seen... It wasn't really odd as much as it was cool. Was um, I think it was Arizona? There was a guy who crowd surfed in a wheelchair. We've had it happen before, but it was great. To, it was 108 degrees, so for people to even move around, it was it was amazing. I love that. I've seen like I, th there's weird items that get crowd surfed yeah. sometimes. I think somebody told me once a prosthetic leg like oh. got up to the stage. We've had a trash can get crowd. -surfed. Well, we had a bunch of trash cans get crowd surfed at the end. We were closing out Warped Tour. We we're headline and warped and. Somebody crowd surfed the trash can, and it was it stayed. It's insane because it stayed upright the whole time. And right when it got to the security guard, it dumped all over the security guard, and we were solid front hit. We're like, oh my god! And he was just covered in like ketchup and that oh, was great. It was awesome. It's a shame though. <laughs> what are the plans for after mayhem? Um, after mayhem, we go home for a little bit. We do not fest. We do some other um, radio festivals, and then. We do some more U.S. We're doing the most U.S. tour we've ever done on this record, but I can't tell you with who. So that's all I can tell you. It's all secret, <laughs> top secret. So what are your expectations for Not Fest? Um, watch Slipknot. That's all I really. I don't even want to play. I just want to watch. I've, I haven't seen Slipknot since I was like 11. Is so. it surreal for you still to kind of share the stage with some of those bands? It's crazy. It's crazy to be hanging out with like Avenged and Corn, and like I loved those bands, and they're just like, "Hey, Levi, how, what's up?" And I'm just like. He knows my name. That's cool. <laughs> so, yeah. That's awesome. I mean, what type of legacy do you hope that Miss May I will leave in the, the rock and metal world? Um, I just want the name. Because we have a weird name. It doesn't mean anything. Our symbol means more. And um, I just want it to be like 50. And when my kids are like, yeah, my dad was in Miss May, I just want people to be like, oh, that's sick. I know that name. So I just want people to know the name. I don't even care if we're selling out arenas when I'm 50. I just want to be known. You're well in your way of doing that. <laughs> thank you. Appreciate awesome. It. Well, I definitely want to thank you for taking a few minutes to speak with me. I appreciate it. It's great to catch up, and like we definitely look forward to seeing a lot more of you guys on the road later this year. I guess. Yeah, we'll be we'll be coming there. I promise.